Well, George, how are you? Oh, fine. <clears throat> I'm fine. Mr. Webb, what sense could there be in a superstition like that? Oh, well, you see, on her wedding morning, a girl's head's apt to be full of clothes and one thing and another. Don't you think that's probably it? Yes. I never thought of that. Yeah, a girl's apt to be a mite nervous on her wedding day. I wish a fella could get married without all that marching up and down. Every man that's ever lived has felt that way about it, George. But it hasn't been any use. It's the women folk who built up weddings, my boy. For a while now, the women have it all their own. A man looks pretty small at a wedding, George. All those good women standing shoulder to shoulder, making sure that knot is tied in a mighty public way. You believe in it, don't you, Mr. Webb? Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, don't you misunderstand me, my boy. No, marriage is a wonderful thing. Wonderful thing. And don't you forget that, George. No, sir. Mr. Webb, how old were you when you got married? Oh, well, you see, I'd been to college, and I'd taken a little time to get settled. But Mrs. Webb, she wasn't much older than what Emily is. Oh, age hasn't much to do with it, George, not compared with uh, other things. What were you going to say, Mr. Webb? Oh, I don't know. Was I going to say something? George, I was thinking the other night of some advice my father gave me when I got married. Charles, he said. Charles, start out early showing who's boss. He said, best thing to do is to give an order, even if it don't make sense, just so she'll learn to obey. Oh, and he said, if anything about your wife irritates you, her conversation or anything, just get up and leave the house. That'll make it clear to her, he said. And oh yes, he said, never, never let your wife know how much money you have. Never. Well, Mr. Webb, I don't think So I, I could... took the opposite of my father's advice, and I've been happy ever since. And let that be a lesson to you, George, never to ask advice on personal matters. George, are you going to raise chickens on your farm? What? Are you going to raise chickens on your farm? Uncle Luke's never been much interested, you but know, I a thought... A book came into my office the other day, George, on the philo system of raising chickens. I want you to read it. I'm thinking of beginning in a small way in the backyard, and I'm going to put an incubator in the cellar. 